Repair Clinic encourages you to perform this procedure safely. In this video, we will show one or more of these icons to alert you when to use caution. Before you replace the insulator gasket on your leaf blower, make sure the engine has cooled. Next, you should remove the wire in boot from the spark plug to prevent the engine from accidentally starting. Unthread the screws to release the air filter cover. Remove the filter and the filter gasket. Next, use a T27 Torx bit to unthread the carburetor mounting bolts and set the air filter housing and carburetor aside. Unthread the bolts securing the insulator. Detach the insulator. This may require some effort. You will need to unthread the screws securing the engine housing and remove the housing to fully access the insulator gasket. If still intact, remove the old gasket. Install the new insulator gasket by positioning it on the cylinder head. Realign the insulator then thread and tighten the bolts. Replace the engine housing and rethread the screws to secure. Confirm that the mounting bolts are inserted through the air filter housing. Now slide on the carburetor, followed by the gasket. Thread the bolts into the insulator and tighten. Reposition the air filter gasket in the housing and realign the air filter in the gasket. Replace the cover and thread the screws to secure. With the repair completed, reattach the wire in boot to the spark plug and your leaf blower should be ready for use.